Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, a lot of clouds around every now and then has been a little bit of partial sunshine coming through the cloud cover. Take a look in Providence right now. Dry for now, but we are tracking showers just getting ready to cross the Connecticut Rhode Island border. We'll show you radar in just a second. Mid and upper 60s right now. Made it to 71 in Providence. It has now dropped back down to about 69 degrees. Looking at Newport at 63 and Smithfield 66. Cloudy skies. You can clearly see a solid area of rain getting ready to cross Connecticut, Rhode Island. Now, based on the latest radar trend and the motion of this, it looks like northern Rhode Island, while you'll get some showers, won't be quite as beneficial as central and southern suburbs and especially along the south shores. The heavier rain is across uh, southern Connecticut, coastal Connecticut. This is tracking to the east, arriving next one to two hours. This is one of a couple of chances for showers, and it's much needed. Tracking a second system on the Ohio, western Pennsylvania border right in here, and this will arrive overnight into tomorrow morning. Now, by tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, and especially the weekend, Right here, look at it, clearing out, drying out, sunshine, a nice weekend ahead. All right, take a look at the forecast for this evening, and based on what I just showed you on the radar, some scattered showers coming through during the early evening, especially central and southern areas as temperatures drop to the upper 50s by 11 p.m. After midnight, overnight tonight, still some additional showers, and they will linger at least into early tomorrow morning. We do start off with cloudy skies. But watch what happens when we switch over into the afternoon and evening. We become partly sunny. That'll do a couple of things. For one, it'll boost the temperatures up into the lower to middle 70s. And while the vast majority of the afternoon is dry, keep an eye to the sky around 5, 6, 7 o'clock in, in the evening. An isolated pop-up shower will develop. Widely scattered, not all locations will get one. And it wouldn't last very long, but a second chance of something more isolated, sporadic, late day and early evening, but a better part of Friday night is actually drying out. Bay forecast some reduced visibility, especially during the morning hours with some early after uh, early morning showers. But boaters be mindful, even though the sun comes out a little bit in the afternoon, there will be a pop up late day uh, shower around four, five, six o'clock in the evening. Beaches, any sunshine tomorrow would be reserved for tomorrow afternoon and much better beach weather both Saturday and into Sunday. So here we are on Friday, becoming partly sunny the second half of the day, lower 70s, a few showers in the morning, a slight chance in the afternoon. Beautiful over the weekend, seasonable temperatures generally in the middle 70s. The nights are comfortable in the 50s, so not nearly as, as warm or as humid as last weekend. In the meantime, but we need rain. We'll get a little bit this evening tonight and for portions, not the entire day, but for portions of Friday. Nice weekend. And for the Special Olympic State Summer Games, he came through. Yeah, looks good. <laughs> All right. Thank you, yeah. Tony. We have more coverage.